Welcome guys, I'll be telling you why I'm considering relocating to Halifax, Nova Scotia. Now this is because of my three weeks visit I had back then in December 2021. Now within these three weeks I've been able to do things I have not been able to my do. present stay here in St. John's Newfoundland for over a year guys. I have not been able to do these things. Now if you're a returning subscriber, thank you. I appreciate you guys. Thank you for coming back to this channel. Thank you for your likes, your comments, your shares. I do appreciate you guys. Now if you're a new subscriber and you have not seen this beautiful face, you're welcome to this channel also here we share canadian experiences we give you about the lifestyle we give you more information things you need to do immigration and things like that several gist information on this channel now take one minute to subscribe down below hit that subscribe button hit your bell button so you get not um, notification about things we have don't forget to like do not forget to share do not forget to comment. This is very important, guys. Do not forget to comment. This gives us more information about things you want to know. Gives us feedback about the videos. So, this is Wale and Tosin's channel. I am Tosin and Wale is behind the camera. Go back to the main video, guys. Now, I will roughly give you similarities between St. John's, Newfoundland, and Halifax, Nova Scotia. There are a few similarities. Now, if you do not know, these provinces are within the Atlantic provinces. Now, we have the New Brunswick, we have Prince Edward Island, we have Nova Scotia, and we have Newfoundland. Now, I would like to say, um, in terms of population, um, Nova Scotia is considered the biggest in terms of population. It is the biggest. Now, the few similarities I'll say is people here are friendly. People in Nova Scotia, Halifax, and people in St. John's, Newfoundland, they are extremely friendly, guys. They just wear the smiley face on the way. They just walk smiley. They are really friendly. Number two, the pathways. We have several pathways for PR. If after your school, you're considering getting your permanent residence, you want to stay back. Yes, there are very various varieties of pathways you can get here in the Atlantic provinces, Newfoundland, Prince Edward Island, New Brunswick, and Nova Scotia. Now the cost of living. Guys, I would say the cost of living is almost the same. There's really no difference for the... So, now back to my main topic. The main reason why I am considering relocating. Number one, guys. Halifax is a beautiful city beautiful like it is so beautiful nice beautiful place to be in the weather now it can be so annoying that during the winter it is really cold the snow especially when you have car you have to shovel back and forth now the weather in halifax is superb for me it's really good because once you have snow you have rain so it's like they walk hand in hand you have snow today, tomorrow it's going to rain. Where you do not have to shovel for your car, you do not have to worry about shovel, shoveling and things like that. Number two, I would say the lifestyle shopping experience. The shopping experiences, we have several malls. They have big malls. Big. When I say massive malls, it is really, really big. Food. The food is cheap. Cheap food really cheap you can get cheap things cheap food cheap meals really good now the clothes now for if you're considering coming to canada or you just migrated into canada or you're just thinking of coming into canada yes or one of these provinces now i know you would have heard about value village now the value village they have in halifax is big big where you can get classy stuffs nice things mm -hmm. like that those clothing are superb clean nice and very good you have varieties their shopping mall is very very big and it's very very big guys you want your winter shoe you want your winter boots you want nice clothing you want sweaters you have different things you can get that the downtown too now the downtown is really really good 
Halifax downtown, that mouth downtown. Now they have nice downtown, big, nice, classy. When we say downtown, it is classy. Now, a lot of things to do in that and uh, their downtown. A lot, a lot. Not just drinking, clubbing. A lot of things, not just meals. A lot of things to do in their downtown compared to what we have here in St. John's. Hardly the job opportunities. We have several job opportunities. You have varieties in Halifax. More opportunities, more chances for new graduates. You're just coming out, you're looking for opportunities, you're looking for a job, reason for going to school. You have more opportunities in Halifax. Within the Atlantic provinces, Halifax is good because you have the calm lifestyle. You have the job opportunities. You can also get a job. And the cost of living is still okay. So it's timid, not really noisy. Okay. No, guys, if you want to know more about Halifax, you want to know more about St. John's, or you, there are information you need to know, comment down below. Then we'll get back to you about those things you want to know. Do not forget to like, do not forget to share, and do not forget to hit the subscribe button, guys. I will see you later. Bye.